after her husband got dementia she visited him every day then her son witnessed the unthinkable when Hazel Cherry's husband was struck down by dementia she did everything she could to ensure that the pair stayed close however it wasn't until years later that their son realized just how inseparable they'd become during their long lives Hazel and Leonard Cherry grew up just a few minutes drive away from each other in small adjacent towns in Texas however it was only at high school that they eventually came into each other's lives and a beautiful romance then blossomed the pair were head over heels in love with each other and continued to date after high school they eventually tied the knot in 1942 and so began a wonderful life together filled with love and happiness indeed they spent almost every waking moment together one of the rare times when the cherries were forced apart was when Leonard joined up with the Army Air Corps during World War II the brave serviceman was stationed at the Carswell base in nearby Fort Worth during his time in the military Leonard helped to train many young pilots the couple were then blessed with a bundle of joy in 1944 when their son David came into the world the news caused the cherries to up sticks and relocate to Fort Worth once the war was over moreover Leonard began working as an auto repair technician so that he could provide for his family however it wasn't long before the pair decided to risk it all by starting up their own business an auto shop known as Cherry Hill it was a successful operation for more than three decades but the cherries decided to call it a day so they could move closer to their grandkids so the cherries moved to Woodway a sleepy Texas town with a population of less than 10,000 it was the ideal location to watch their grandchildren grow older and to live out the rest of their own years yes the pair were so close that they rarely spent a day apart during their long lives their son David has even claimed that his parents never argued during their marriage in 2016 he told people they never really spent a day apart unless it was for a family emergency or something and I never heard a crossword between them I never heard them raise their voices to each other unless they were calling across the yard they didn't fight the couple also enjoyed a beautiful bond with their grandchildren and great-grandchildren and while speaking about the moments that they enjoyed with his kids and grandchildren David was full of praise the kids just adored my parents he told people they had such a special relationship they were so close and came to all of their school events when my son was growing up dad came to all of his basketball games the pair lived a happy and fruitful life that was until tragedy struck Leonard was diagnosed with dementia and he was later moved to a care facility in the city of Waco Hazel would visit him assist with his care and even moved into an independent living facility in the same building so that they could remain close she cared tirelessly for Leonard and stayed with him throughout much of his illness as David explained to people up until the very end until right before they died she was with him every day and ate lunch with him in his room there was no question that their love was always there Hazel lived a full life and could regularly be seen driving to and from the grocery store until just a few weeks before she died well her husband's health went downhill in the latter years of his life Hazel passed away suddenly in October of 2016 she started getting tired and weaker and on the day she passed she couldn't get out of bed David explained to people my daughter was talking to her when she blinked smiled and let go the family couldn't bear to break the news to Leonard however just a few hours later he too passed away a caregiver at the facility said that he'd been restless before suddenly becoming calm and breathing his last breath on earth family members were baffled by the fact that the lifelong sweethearts passed away within mere hours of each other David believes that the two had such a strong connection that Leonard before he died could sense that his wife had passed away moreover David has said that perhaps divine intervention may have played a role in the two passing away just hours apart he's always claimed that the ending is exactly what the couple themselves would have chosen it's what God wanted he told people and I think it's what they wanted too. in the hours follow in the hours following their deaths family members paid tribute to the couple who they described as remaining deeply in love the pair will now spend eternity together after they were laid to rest following a memorial service close to their home David added that the couple will be missed by all who knew them it's kind of hard you know you can't pick up the phone and call them anymore he said the more I began to think about it I began to smile because of how much they loved each other 
Despite the sadness however the couple's son is happy that the pair are now in peace together and that his father's suffering at the hands of dementia has passed I feel blessed that daddy's suffering is over and I feel blessed that mom is with him and that she didn't have to live alone he said to CNN in 2016 speaking about the couple's legacy David's son Craig said that they taught him how to love all people meanwhile he believes that the couple will meet once again in the afterlife there's no question in my mind that my grandmother was waiting for him in heaven with open arms Craig Cherry told Fox 6 News in 2016 the incident is not the first of its kind however there have in fact been many lifelong couples who have passed away within hours of each other in 2016 a New Zealand husband and wife died just hours apart following seven decades of marriage and in another case a couple of 58 years passed away while holding each other's hands proof perhaps that love really does last forever please share this video with your friends below